All right, hey, what's going on guys? This week I'm bringing you 3D printed accessories for the DJI Mavic Mini. That will enhance your experience while you're flying this drone. In my last video, we brought you a couple accessories for the Fly More Combo Kit. And afterwards, I discovered that the controller's joysticks will actually hit the top of the Fly More Combo Case. Whether you have a box inside or not, you can actually see right here where my joysticks were hitting. Here, joysticks are hitting. We went through a bunch of different variations and versions of this before we finally settled on the design that we have here, which is this right here. So it protects the controller when you close the kit. So it hits actually the outside rim of this controller here. So the joysticks themselves aren't accidentally pushed in and damaged. So that's our first one. Next up, I have a strobe mount that I've been developing. This actually uses a Flytron strobe on Cree, which I got from ReadyMade RC, but is also available on Amazon. Links are in the description. As you can see, it's a small piece of 3D printed plastic. It only weighs five and a half grams with the strobe on it. And it clips in right there. And you can see it's, it's really, it's not going anywhere. So I recommend using a extra set of legs or hand launching and catching, which is my preferred method. It can still be launched from the ground, but I don't recommend it as it can damage the props or the LED. See the LED kind of sticks out there. And then, uh, you know, it could be at like an odd angle like this and cause your propellers to hit the ground or, or something or, or it, it generally be unstable. So I'm also working on a leg mount, uh, which I'll, I'll put up a video. I don't think I have one here. Yeah, I don't have one up here, but I'm, I'm working on a leg mount that will work here or here or here or here. I'm actually thinking about moving them to here. So it has more of a uh, wider view. So these leg mounts, they're also going to use the Flytron strobe on so you can attach each of the strobes to the leg, making the orientation easier to determine, which meets the Academy of Model Aeronautics AMA requirement for night flying. If you're a hobbyist flying under the AMA rules, you should probably understand what that means before you go flying at night. The strobe on does meet the requirements for part 107.29 daylight operations, which has to do with dusk and dawn flying, which is three statute miles visibility when flying in the 30 minute window before sunrise or after sunset. It is a, it's a little rough. You can see here that on the sides here, it's, it's really difficult for us to get like a perfect print. Unlike some of our other prints here, you can see that are, are very, you know, nicely made. What that means is this favors function over form. So if you do decide to order it, understand that it's going to contain some minor imperfections and you can see here, Look how bright that is. I saw some, uh, some guys were commenting that there's, uh, on eBay and Alibaba, a smaller led that'll fit like here and here, uh, and, and here, I guess. And from what I saw, it looked like that was a really, really cheap led. So, uh, it's not going to provide this very bright strobe where you can see from three statute miles. So be careful of what looks like too good of a deal. The strobes for 18 bucks on ready-made RC and they're 28 bucks on Amazon. So the last thing we have today is a lens hood mount. And you can see this is the lens hood mount. It's very simple. Again, it's kind of a rougher print. It doesn't look as pretty as our other ones, but it favors function over form. It attaches very easily. Actually, I think it attaches is more easy than this does. Uh, and I can, it does not go anywhere. It is not falling off. We made it our best efforts in order to match the color of the Mavic mini. So this is like our Mavic gray to give it kind of an OEM look. And we did our best to make sure it's lightweight and strong. It weighs about three grams. But you can see here, I mean, it is, it's pretty strong. I mean, I'm, I'm putting some significant pressure on here. So 
it's it's very strong. You got these little nubs here that are supposed to be there to kind of help protect it some more. But again, understand this 3D printing is not the same as most consumer products. It's gonna contain some slight imperfections, but will retain functionality. It's designed to prevent lens flares and glares at certain angles by acting as a visor to your lens, kind of like how our hat works. Lens hood will not help when the sun is actually in your shot, but it can reduce extra light from reflections. It's also gonna provide with some protection in the event of crash, but it's not guaranteed to help or stop any damage. It also won't show up any shots unless you're in sport mode and you're rapidly turning. And you gotta have like this kind of like 15 degree down angle like you see there. So, so the way the gimbal works is it mostly just moves up and down. It has a little bit of left and right play when you're turning but you can't turn it left and right like the Mavic 2 Pro. Right now we're only printing these two in this gray color to give it that OEM look. If you want it in any other colors, let us know in the comments and we'll talk to Miss Chrissy Co and see if we can get other ones printed. So if that's what you want, please let us know in the comments. Last thing is uh, we're doing this video because you guys asked for it. You guys asked for some, uh, for this lens hood. Uh, I've been working on the strobe. You guys loved it, asked for it. So we're getting it together. And then of course, uh, the this is because we discovered an issue. Uh, and I personally don't want to be responsible for any of you guys breaking your sticks because I recommended something to you. And yeah, that's gonna be it. If you, if you like this kind of content, then go ahead and subscribe. Uh, if you don't, let us know in the comments how we can do it better. And that's gonna be it guys. We're gonna see you next time. Wow.